Good morning. I got up super early this morning so I could get ready before I get the babies up. Um, we're leaving for a six hour road trip today, but it'll probably end up being more like seven, seven and a half hours with the babies and I'm taking my electric car. So I have to stop and charge it, which does complicate things a little bit and um, would have preferred to take Nathan's truck, but that just didn't work out. So that's okay. Um, I'm about to make my bed and then I'm going to go get the babies up and then load the car and we're going to leave. on like that I've ever found and their favorite are these water bottles with like the zip thing on the top and they like them big because I think they think it looks like mine so I bought another one of these yesterday for a road trip today Load the car, and then I will see you guys after that. Are you guys getting all the nanas? Here. Yeah. Okay. All right, let's go to your side. You're so smart. Huh? Whoop. Your drink and your bear. Okay, the car is loaded, the babies are buckled, time for a road trip. I'm so bummed that Leah couldn't drive with us. She flies standby um, and we are going to a bachelorette weekend in Texas. So I'm taking the babies to my in-laws who live like six hours away. So she couldn't come with us. She had to fly out of Virginia because the, the flights in South Carolina were just too tight. So it's just me and the babies, but I'm really excited. They're in a really good mood. Um, the weather's beautiful. It's gonna be a really good day. We've been driving for almost three hours. The boys have been so good, but I can tell they need to like get out and stretch. So um, the car is on 17%. So I'm gonna put it on the charger and we're gonna go find some food. We could probably make it there with just this charge, but I'll probably stop one more time so they can stretch and we can get there with more battery. Okay. Those are really big muscles. Just bought these little chickens from um, popcorn chicken from Walmart. <laughs> and they'll just run up and grab one every time they're hungry, but I'm just letting them walk through the store. Are you going to take it this time? <laughs> They're very, very impressed with the claw machines. Okay, and the car's charged. Um, we're gonna do some quick diaper changes and then we're gonna get on the road again. So we're back in the car. All the diapers have been changed. I went to the bathroom. We ate some food. We're fully charged. About to get back on the road again. I'm like heavily contemplating whether we should stop again. I'm just gonna see how they do um, on this next round. They're watching a movie right now, so. Hopefully we can just push through, but if they start getting upset, I'm gonna let them out again so they can stretch and move and wiggle. I'm like so tired. Um, I can feel my eyes just getting heavy. So I'm gonna get a coffee Then we're gonna charge, go to the bathroom, do diaper changes, same drill again. I'm gonna let them get their wiggles out, but we're making really good time and we're gonna get there before dinner. So I'm happy about that. They've been amazing. Like best little car riding buddies. How are you today? Can I get a grande doppio iced espresso with one pump of white mocha and a splash of oat milk with vanilla cold foam? It's a um, long order, <laughs> but it's so good. It's my favorite, favorite, favorite coffee right now from Starbucks. Okay, hey, I'm gonna go plug her in and we're gonna go for a walk. Do you guys wanna go for a walk? Love you. Love you. Oh, big strong guy. Yeah. Yeah. We're 
we're killing time. <laughs> 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 We're in a much bigger parking lot this time, so I baby wore Theo and I let Charlie run because it didn't feel safe to keep up with four boots and two babies. Yes. What? What? Really? We need to wipe your face, huh? Road tripping in an electric car is and it can be really stressful sometimes. And while I do love my car, I don't want to like glamorize it, especially with kids, because like when we pulled up to this plug to charge, it wouldn't start. And I like kept my calm, but like I moved to another charging station and I tried to plug it in, wouldn't start. And I was like, oh my gosh, what am I gonna do? Like, we could probably make it there without any charge, but like I need to charge the car. And so I'm like trying to figure out what to do. The babies are starting to get cranky. They're starting to cry. Cause like they want to stretch and stuff. And um, this guy comes up and he was like, can I help you? literally the sweetest sweetest man calls the support team for me at like these charging stations and i just needed my app to be reset so they reset the app for me and it started working perfectly but like he was so sweet he saw that i had the twins and he just took care of it for me like called them figured it out plugged in my car he even tried to use his own like money like he tried to pay because he thought it was something wrong with like my card or my phone and i was like no you can't do that and he was like well i already tried it didn't work like just the sweetest man anyways all that to say like it can be stressful but like i'm so thankful for the support team i'm so thankful for that man he literally took the time out of his day to help us and it was just the sweetest thing so anyways we are fully charged we're on the last leg of our trip we'll be there in less than two hours and i'm so ready <laughs> i'm so ready to get there we just pulled up it is 5 40 and we have 42%. The babies are waking up. They've been sleeping this whole time. <laughs> They've been sleeping this whole time. Um, so we made it. I feel so good about it. I'm tired, but it was not that bad. It was a little bit stressful at times, but like as good as I could have hoped. <laughs> well, we survived the road trip. We're at grandma and grandpa's now. Um, I came an extra day early, said, oh, careful, baby. Don't protect your teeth. Yeah, protect your teeth. So I wanted to get here a day early so I could get the boys all settled in and then adjusted. They love their grandparents' house, but I just wanted to make sure that they were the most comfortable since I'm going to be gone for like a day and a half. Oh, okay. Hey, are you teething? Don't bite mommy. We're probably just going to go to the park, get them all settled in and cozy. Yeah, that sounds good. That sounds good. And I will see you guys tomorrow when I'm getting ready to fly out. 4 a.m. Um, my taxi's gonna be here in like 15 minutes. So I'm gonna get dressed really quick and we're going to the airport. I'm ready. I need to go put my shoes on and go outside because I think my taxi's here. So it's 25 minutes later and I'm still at the house. <laughs> my flight leaves in like an hour and 30 minutes and I have no ride to the airport right now. I just called an Uber. The taxi's not coming. I just called him. He um, was asleep. I called him 15 minutes ago and he was like, oh, hello. And I was like, um, is anyone coming to pick me up? And he was like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just going to be like 25 more minutes Sir, like I should have left like 10 minutes ago. I have to go. I have to go. I have to go. So, um, I canceled my time <laughs> And I called an uber. So, okay, I should still make it there in enough time to get on my flight But the airport's like 30 35 minutes away. So wish me luck. My uber driver is like three minutes away But it took her 20 minutes to get here. So like I'm legit feeling really nervous right now Ooh, it's cold out here. I just got to the airport and I have 40 minutes before takeoff, which should be fine. I just gotta scoot through security fast. I made it to my gate with time to spare, so I went and got a little coffee because I'm freezing and a little breakfast to eat. 
but I kept feeling like I was forgetting something. I was like, what am I missing? Like, oh. And I realized this is the first time I've ever traveled without my babies. They're almost two. And since I've had them, this is my first trip without them. So I feel so, so grateful to be able to just like celebrate my new sister-in-law and just, you know, be with my sisters and just focus on sister time. But like, man, like, I can't believe I'm here without them. My worst nightmare is the plane going down while I'm on the toilet. Can you imagine? I landed, I'm outside, waiting for my little sister Vic to pick me up. First step on the agenda, um, we're getting buckled. We need to go get Leah, is what we need to do. We need to get Leah. Yeah, we do it too mobile. Yeah, we have to, Victoria, what happened to your phone, Victoria? I lost my phone in a lake. She's on my phone plan. I let her be on my phone plan and I brought her a new phone, so we have to go get a new Sims card. Oh my God! <laughs> You're so two regular hot donuts. Yeah, say that, Vic. Um, two glazed donuts. Okay, my glaze. Look how cute. Okay, I'm gonna try. That's delicious. That is so delicious. It's gonna hurt my stomach right now. <laughs> we got it. All right, we got Mick's phone all figured out. Thank you, YouTube. <laughs> we just parked to pick up Leah. Our other sisters are gonna drop her off. <laughs> yeah. So my mother and father-in-law made um, us freeze-dried candies. Can you guys see? Drive this little puff. I want to say a shell. Put it in. Oh, you're good. We got a Chipotle bowl. Mid. Tasty. Now we have to get back on the road. Yay. Hey guys, welcome to my vlog. We're road tripping to San Antonio, right? Because that's where the party is. We are like. Why is the tour so hot? <laughs> so true. Stop. And we're like, how many hours in? Two and a half hours in. We have like an hour yeah, left. Like an hour We've been forcing Leah to drive. Yeah, but they buy me food, so. I bought her food and her... And, they were, <laughs> and, and my her son. Her and she's the youngest. That's so true. Try you better learn your rules. If you don't, you'll be eaten in your seat. <laughs> oh! She wants to That's so true. Vic, your teeth are shiny. I wiped them last night. <laughs> well, what the hell? What the hell? Is she prepped? You should probably think about the window. <laughs> Five minutes from the house, and we look over and they, they show show them the. Just, <laughs> what is that? <laughs> what what's that? And she goes. The gas light turned on forty miles ago, but there's forty gallons in there before it goes empty. Leah, fumes. I hear the motor going. <laughs> <laughs> they said we all didn't tell us to stop gas. <laughs> We too. made it to the house, but we are rushing to get ready because everyone else is ready. But it took us like four hours to get here, which is longer than we expected. And it's also spring break weekend. So we're going to be fighting the crowd to get to dinner. <sighs> Just go really quick. Just go really quick. They're not going to yell at you. Just go, Victoria. You're supposed to wear like a really pretty, like bright, vibrant color dress with a colored wig. Theme is final fiesta. Blend, 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 blend. This is gonna have to do because I have to put my clothes on. I'm gonna introduce you guys to all my sisters because everyone's here. I put, no, don't do it like that. Why? How did you do it? Did you do it on the top of your head? No. Do it. What did you do? Okay, come do it. <laughs> this is my oldest sister, Maddie. Hi. <laughs> your face. Okay. Um, I think I. Wait, order just. Um, stunning! The dress I'm wearing is this little girl. I'm gonna put this on and I'll be back. Okay. Woo! You have Leah the dress. Get this little, oh my goodness. Yeah. Somebody here. Yeah. This better be the stripper. <laughs> what I need. <laughs> okay. Look at Leah. I look like a cupcake. We are getting out to go eat dinner. Back at the house. <laughs> the next morning, I got up. 
getting ready because we're going to Six Flags. But it's like a 70% chance of raining today, so wish us luck. I'm not much of a morning person. <laughs> uh, push your hair. <laughs> I look like Lola. I'll show you guys my outfit. Lola. So cute. Oh, they want to see my outfit too. Yeah, of course. And this is Lulu's shirt. And then my Vejas. We're heading out the house. Mm -hmm. We were only staying here one night, so we're going to Six Flags and then, then we're going home. Look at my hair. I fly home early tomorrow. I think it's cute, like a little top knot. Oh my god, mm. the water. <gasps> we had to get coffee and now we're going to the park, I guess. Six Flags! <laughs> we have arrived. <laughs> it is really cold and it's wet. Ride. I think you'll be like, so excited to be on the ride, you won't even notice. <laughs> I rode this oh, ride when I was young. <laughs> oh my gosh. How was that? Oh my God, oh my God. Oh. <laughs> uh, we just got off that ride. What were your thoughts? I loved it. <laughs> it was so cold. It was so I got cold. Tears dripping down. What were your thoughts? Look at her hairs. I look at her hair. I thought my ears were going to like freeze off and fall. <laughs> right. I'm literally crying. That was so cold. Just waited like an hour and a half to get on a ride oh, and it good. broke down. And they had to like take everyone off we the were ride. The second people. We were about to get yeah, on. It's starting to rain and so we're just going to leave and go get food and warm up because we're all freezing. It was so cold when we got back to the car. We defrosted for like 30 minutes. I can finally feel my fingers again. We are going home now. It's like a three and a half hour drive. We have Marsha and Leah. We're gonna stop at Bucky's and get some food. And a pudding. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, the beaver is out. <laughs> okay, we're gonna give you guys a Bucky's haul really quick. We got a drink. If you ever come to Bucky's, you have to get the banana pudding. It's so good. Oh. Pickles. Spicy pickles. Sliced brisket sandwich. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. And then I got a Rice Krispie chip. Cause you have to eat the brisket with your pickles. With the pickles. I'm putting mine in the bread. Mm. 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 Okay, girl, show us your haul. Literally, tell me this blueberry muffin does not look like the best. Mm. Not a hot dog. The sugar got one, the, like the pickled ones. Pick hot. So we're back at my parents' house. Um, this is where I'm staying the night tonight before I fly out tomorrow. Um, but I was telling my sister Marsh. <laughs> I was telling her that I need to be at the airport like tomorrow at 5 a.m. And she was like, no way, me too. Like, I have to be up so early tomorrow. Come to find out, she's working the flight that I'm taking home tomorrow to North Carolina. I guess I have a ride to the airport in the morning. I miss the kids so much. I can't wait to get home to them. And I guess I can tell you guys now because by the time I post this, it'll be like past and whatnot. It'll be safe to talk about. But Nathan will be home when we get home tomorrow. And I'm so excited. We are on our way to Marsha's gonna work the flight, so she's in her flight attendant uniform. She looks very cute. Also, I'm allowed to keep my tray table down if I want to, and my seat reclined, so don't come by me. We're in the employee parking lot, and we're gonna take the employee bus. So cold. The flight is looking really full, so we don't know if Leah's gonna get on. If I stayed up till 5 a.m. for no stay <laughs> up. I better get on this flight. Uh, eight more minutes. We have made it online. I'm so happy I don't have to do so close. the road really trip home by myself because as soon as we land in Charlotte, we have, we have a six hour drive with the babies. We're getting the babies and driving back to Virginia. So I'm so glad you're here. <laughs> Where are you? <laughs> yes. There's an open seat here. <laughs> off the flight and my mother and father-in-law are picking well they're meeting us here at the airport with my car and the babies we're about to see the babies so we can head straight home um to see nathan and they're trying right now to charge it for us um which is so sweet that way we can get as far as possible before having to stop and charge <laughs> hold this for me thank you oh you want me to take it? Okay. We got the babies. Mm, I miss them hey, so much. 
Yeah. Um, and now we're gonna head home. And Nathan's already there, so we're about to see him. So hungry, so Leah's running into the subway. Uh, there's double this. Uh. Okay, we're charging now. Um, we're gonna get the babies out and let them stretch. We're charging at a Shades gas station this time. So we're just hanging out in the car, eating some snacks. We rolled in on 15%. Um, people always ask how much it costs to charge up. And in public, it's usually around like $25. And it takes about anywhere from like 30 to 45 <laughs> minutes to charge. I missed you. <laughs> I'm so happy to be back with you. You got it? Let's go fill it up. Oh, I do. <laughs> Me and Leah were just talking about the last time we did this road trip. We stopped at this gas station and we had to baby wear them. Because they were so little. Now they're running around. I know. <laughs> Picnic. Oh, you want to hold my hand? Yes, sir. <laughs> we're back on the road and we're about two hours from the house. I just want to get home and shower. We made it home. I'm so pooped. Um, the last three hours were not fun. Um, I feel like one of the babies was upset. I feel like like they were so on and off with each other that like somebody was upset almost for the last three hours total. But we're home. We made it. We did it. Nathan's giving them a bath right now. We haven't seen him in over a month. So we're just going to be together as a family now. And um you made it this far into my vlog thank you for watching and i'll see you guys soon